Okay, here we are on day six of our worm bin. I went in and I uh, tried not to check on them because they're new and you kind of want to see what they're doing, but I uh, added one little piece of scrap cucumber. Scrap cucumber and uh, we'll see what they did. It did seem like it was a little bit dry. I mean, that's how it is at first. Take the lid off, see how it looks. Sorry about the flip flops and the socks, but I'm just in the uh, garage here. And uh, yeah, see how it goes. So, I did come in and I sprayed this yesterday because um, it was like pretty dry. And I see here, got like a worm ball here. Let's put this, uh, make sure there's no worms in between. here so the as you can see here I did I did see that some uh, here's one on the side here um, there were some castings in here and there was a worm on the side uh, I don't think you see that there but so there's a little bit of castings in this corner here um, there's a huge worm ball right here like when I first got it once they kind of warmed up a little bit and got acclimated there's a huge worm ball here now there's a bunch here so um, I'm going to guess that they ate all the food, but let's kind of look through and see. And this feels, to me, it feels dry. It's definitely not, I can't squeeze it and get water out of it. So I think I'm going to add a bit more water to it. I don't know. I hope I'm right, but let's see. Here is one of the uh, strawberry tops. So they've ate that. I put in like four or something. So I can see if I can find any more. I know they didn't eat the green part yet, but it looks like they've eaten all the strawberry tops. I just can't find them. They seem to be kind of all throughout the bin, which is good. I was worried when I first got them, they were clumping. Um, so, so that's good. Yeah, I don't know where the heck... No way they could have eaten the, there's a worm ball here. A few of them here. Feels really, well, the paper's still kind of wet, but it still feels dry. I do like how they're kind of spread out everywhere. Yeah, I don't know, looks like I'm not very good at <laughs> finding the stuff that I put in, but, so I'm pretty sure they ate all the strawberries. Uh, I doubt they ate the tops. I just can't find them. They were in the middle here in the feeding zone. So um, I'll mix this up a little bit, I guess. I think it's way too dry. So we'll just put some more water in. Now the cucumber is I put over here. And there's a bunch of worms here. I did check on it the second day and there was already a bunch of worms eating it. But looks like that's gone too. So that's so good. Looks like they're happy, they're not trying to escape. Um, they did, <clears throat> after I sprayed the water, they have been caught on the side. You see a guy here and there's some castings and stuff on the side. So they are. First, as soon as I put the cover on, they explored, uh, you know, out of the, out of the bin. But um, they seem to be happy and staying in. Um, yeah, I do not see that. So, so that's good. I don't see the cucumber, so I'm gonna kind of feed them more. And uh, hopefully they'll be they'll be happy. So it seems pretty airy still, but kind of dry. So. Let's see, I'll make the feeding zone. I don't know if I need more, more paper. I'll put a little bit down. But. Okay, so here. Feeding zone. And I have a mix of. That's my shredder doesn't do. It does a cross cut, but not a super fine cross cut. So. 
I think I'll just do that. I don't know if I should spray it. Maybe I'll spray it a little bit. Let's get more moisture in here. The food I'm putting in is frozen. So that will uh, add a bunch of moisture and hopefully it's not too much. But So what do we have? We have um, a little bit of lettuce. Kind of put that in here. We got the strawberry tops. Two, three, four. These two are frozen together. Let's try to get them apart. So five. That was a small one. It's a little piece. Let's see if I can split that up. Or if it's still too frozen. Oh well, they'll figure it out. All right, kind of put that one there. We'll put that one right in the middle. Then over here, and then we have some more cucumber because they seem to like that pretty good. So I'll put a bunch of cucumbers and I have a little bit of lettuce. This is the only thing that's not frozen is this lettuce here. And uh, this was frozen, but the, the other, the leaves are, they're not, they were just scraps from today. And then uh, this little potato, maybe I'll put the potato like kind of over here. So then we know where it is. Yeah, I'll put a little bit of. And there and the potato oh and then we have our so i made our pulverized i just did the eggshells got the magic bullet and uh pulverize in there hope you can see that and uh turns into a powder so let's see here sprinkle that on top Hopefully that's good. And then I just have some oats. That same thing. Sprinkle that a little bit. All right. Close it up. And we'll see how they're doing next week. Six or seven days from now. Here, eat the rest of this stuff. Should be about even. All right. So hopefully it'll be exciting when we come back. Seven days, see how they're doing. Put the paper on top. And then we're there. So maybe I'll spray this a bit more. It's pretty dry in the garage right now. So that's it. Uh, I did, you can see here, I did put the, uh, let's see. I just used, I didn't have any, any uh, screen, and I just kind of put pantyhose with a uh, rubber band. You can see that, where is it there? Oh, there it is. So pantyhose with a rubber band, uh, just to kind of block that so nothing get, can get in. No, like, spiders or whatever. And um, that's it. That's where I got the worms from. Mother's worms. They seem to be alive and doing well and eating. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay, like and subscribe. We'll see you next week for this worm series.